So climate change is without question a very controversial subject. I doubt if everybody in this room has the same view as everybody else. But today, I'm going to talk about the models that are used to help us understand what is going on. But climate modelling is really hard, it's really uncertain, and we lack much of the data that we need. I do a lot of work with the Met Office, and the Met Office use what we call a hierarchy of models to predict the weather and the climate. So these are various models that are used over short time scales and very good resolution at small length scales. We have modern weather forecasting models. If we go to much longer time scales like 100 years or more, which is what we need to be able to forecast the climate in such a way that policymakers can take action, and where we're trying to look at whole earth systems and coupled models, we get these things here, um, like HADGEM 3, and that will work over 100 years and over um, length scales of about 100 kilometers. So this is the sort of stuff that's going on in the kind of scientific world to try to understand the way our climate is changing. <laughs> 